Welcome to Academy 23. My name is Abraham. I'll be your host. Welcome to all for a brand new episode of Current Affairs. Today we will discuss the important matters across the globe. First, the international sector. India contributes 5 million US dollars to UNRWA. India has contributed 5 million US dollars to United Nations Relief and Works Agencies for Palestinian refugees in the Near East. The contribution was provided in support of UNRWA's core programs and services including education, health care and relief and social services. Next is the national news. National flag of India creates a world record. Ahead of India's 72nd Independence Day celebrations, several students and several members of social organizations unfurled a 15 km long national flag by forming a human chain in Raipur, Chhattisgarh. The event was conducted by Vasudev Kutumbagam Foundation. According to the Government Public Relations Department, the event had entered the Champions Book of World Records for the longest tricolor. Rajya Sabha passes Consumer Protection Bill. The Parliament has approved a Consumer Protection Bill 2019 on August 6. The bill is to revamp the process of administration and settlement of consumer disputes with strict penalties including jail term for adulteration and misleading ads by companies. The Consumer Protection Bill 2019 was already passed by Lok Sabha and this was approved in the Upper House by Voice Vote. The bill will replace the Consumer Protection Act 1986. Next is Business and Economy. Apple launches credit card with Goldman Sachs. Apple Corporation has collaborated with Goldman Sachs to start the issue of its credit card that is named Apple Card. The issue has been started from August 6, 2019. The transactions are authorized by Apple Pay. Saudi Aramco partners with Reliance Industries. The Saudi Arabian oil company Saudi Aramco will buy a 20% stake in Reliance Industries oil refinery and chemical business. The announcement was made during the 42nd annual general meeting of Reliance Industries by Reliance Industries Limited Chairman Mugesh Ambani on August 12th. Mugesh Ambani quoted that the Reliance Industries Saudi Aramco deal would be one of India's largest foreign direct investment deals to date. The deal was made at a value for over 5.3 lakh crores. Geo Fiber to launch on September 5th. At the 42nd Annual General Meeting of Reliance Industries Limited, Chairman Mugesh Ambani announced the launch of Geo Fiber broadband services in India. It will be launched on September 5th, 2019. Next is appointments. ONGC and IOC gets new directors. Rajesh Kumar Srivastava has taken over as the new director of Oil and Natural Gas Corporation. In a statement issued by Indian Oil Corporation, Sandeep Kumar Gupta has taken over as the director of finance of the company. Yes Bank appoints Anurag Adalka as Chief Financial Officer. Yes Bank announced the appointment of Anurag Adalka as Chief Financial Officer. Adalka was earlier Senior Group President and Head of Financial Management and Strategy. Sonia Gandhi as Interim Congress President. 
Sonia Gandhi was named as the interim Congress president after Rahul Gandhi refused to reconsider his decision to step down. The decision was taken by the Congress Working Committee on August 10, 2019. Sonia Gandhi will return to be the interim Congress chief until the party holds elections to elect a new leader. Next is Awards and Honours. National Film Awards declared. The 66th National Film Awards were announced by Rahul Ravel, head of the jury for feature films on August 9, 2019. Best Actor Award was given to Aishman Khurana for Andandur and Vicky Kaushal for Yuri the Surgical Strike. Best Actress Award was given to Kirti Suresh for Mahanadi. Best Director Award was given to Aditya Dhar for the movie Yuri the Surgical Strike. Best Feature Film was Hallaru, a Gujarati film directed by Abhishek Shah. Abhinandan Vartaman to get Veer Chakra. The Wing Commander Abhinandan Vartaman will be awarded Veer Chakra, India's third highest wartime gallantry medal. The Defence Ministry announced the military awards on the eve of Independence Day celebrations. Lastly, Books and Others Hillary and Chelsea Clinton are teaming up to write a book. Hillary Clinton and her daughter Chelsea Clinton are to write a book called The Book of Gutsy Women to honor famous women personalities. The book will be published by Simon & Schuster Publications on October 1st, 2019. And that's all for now. This is your host, Abraham, signing off. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please feel free to subscribe, like and share.